So the Rays re-signed relief pitcher Jazz Rowe on a major league contract for one year and $1.15 million. It's a good contract. I It's a really good contract for a player like Jazz Rowe. I mean, he had a good year last year until he got injured. And, you know, it's good to have Jazz Rowe back. You know, he was a reliable pitcher, like I said last year. Not the same as he was in 2019, where he was kind of a, uh, you know, Mr. I'm going to give up a bunch of home runs, but, you know, Jazz Rowe is uh, back with the Rays, and, you know, I thought we would lose him to a different team, because, you know, I know we have one man left on a, not one man, one spot left on a 40-man roster, but, you know, Beeks, Poche, McKay, all are on IL, so, yeah, I, I thought, okay, so, looks like we're just going to save that spot for a pitcher, but that most likely, now that Rowe is signed to a major league contract, he's most likely going to be on a 40-man roster. And it's most likely that we're going to be trading another pitcher when we activate either Beeks, Poche, or McKay. But until that happens, we will worry about that. But for now, not worried about that. But this is a good re-signing for the Rays. You know, well, of course, this isn't the first pitcher we've re-signed. You know, we signed Oliver Drake, and I know Chris Archer hasn't been on the team for the last couple of years, but he's a Braves legend. I consider this a re-signing, so, yeah. Reuniting with our pitchers this year, and, well, Andrew Kittredge, but minor league contract, and I highly doubt he's going to get playing time. Hopefully not, but, anyways, uh, glad Jazz Rose back on the team, and, Hopefully the bullpen still stays strong with him, and hope he makes the team, because, you know, I liked his stuff last year, even if it was just only a slider. So, yeah. Uh, anyways, that's really all I have to say about this, and uh, go Rays, and let's head back to the World Series.